Good morning, friends. Happy Tuesday. Greetings, greetings. Hi, everybody. Send me your greetings. What have you got? What have you got? What have you got? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Ooh, yes. I love that butterfly, especially for springtime. Yes, keep it up. Yes, thumbs up. Good job, guys. All right. So, safekeepers. What do we have to do to stay safe? What is our focus? Do you remember what we talked about last week and yesterday? Yes, yeah, social distancing, wearing our masks, washing our hands, and not putting our hands near our mouths because our hands have lots of germs on them because they touch everything. I need everyone to keep that in mind for a little longer. I'm sure someone will let you know when we don't have to worry about it so much, but right now we have to be very diligent. That means Staying focused and keeping those germs away from us and wearing our masks like we are supposed to and staying six feet apart from people, okay? All right, so if you'll help keep us safe today, give me a thumbs up and let's hear it. I'll help keep us safe today. Nice job, thank you. So now we need to wish everyone well. We wish you well, we wish you well. All through the day today, we wish you well, but What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather outside? Is it sunny? Is it raining? Is it cloudy or is there fog? Raise a hand if you see sunshine. Oh my gosh, that looks like just about everybody. Okay, if you see clouds out your window, you just go ahead and say clouds. Oh, I hear a couple. Anybody see rain? Just say rain. Oh, yep, there's one. Yep, okay. All right. Well, I see sunshine out my window. So hopefully today is going to be a beautiful day. Um, we're heading into spring and hoping to see those leaves. I'm very excited. I love the sunshine. It warms everything up. So there's our weather for today. Now the calendar, we need to do some counting because yesterday was Monday and the 20th. 22nd and today is Tuesday the 23rd. 23 right there. It's very hard to see because my calendar is a little bit bendy. I'm gonna try. Stay, 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 calendar. Oh, it's listening. Okay, so we have the clap count all the way to 23. Are we ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Yay, we made it to 23. All right. So who remembers what we're talking about this week? This beautiful sunny day it probably brings us some memories of spring. This is our spring song. The sun is shining bright. The sun is shining bright. Oh, how I love the warmth. The sun is shining bright. The rain is falling down. The rain is falling down. Oh, how I love the sound. The rain is falling down. The flowers start to bloom. The flowers start to bloom. Oh, how I love the sight. The flowers start to bloom. And our craft is about Flowers, yes, we're making our pollen planting activity. So I did not get a chance to color in mine in blue, and that's okay. Um, but I have my dirt and I have my clouds. And so today we're gonna be taking our, I am going to be taking my green paper, I think. Yes, I'm gonna be making my, let me make sure I have glue first. If you don't have glue or you don't have construction paper, but you do have markers, you can draw your flower stems and leaves on with a marker. Just trying to see if I have a little bit more glue. Okay, so I do not. I'm going to have to go get some because I'd really like to glue mine, I think. So I am going to cut mine out and I can glue them in later. So 
So I'm going to start cutting out my thumbs and leaves. And I think the easiest way for me to do that is, I think I'm just going to, I fold it in half. I'm just going to cut out strips for the stems. I think I'm going to try to do 10. I don't know if 10 will fit on my paper and it's okay if you can't fit 10. You don't have to do all 10. Um, that'll probably do one, two, eight. I'll just do one more set of strips. And I'll take all of these. And I'm going to make them a little bit shorter. They're kind of long for stems. I think I'll maybe do some longer ones and some shorter ones. So I won't cut it right in the middle. I'll make some longer and I'll make some shorter. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and take this piece of paper. I think I'm gonna fold it a few times. the leaves to be too big, but I'm thinking I could probably just go ahead and make myself some real simple leaves by folding it up. You can cut a lot of them at one time. I'm going to try to do that. Fold it one more time. Fold it back up. I cut that one out. We're going to go ahead and What? A dog is staring at me. No, go see brother. Go ask brother. Go upstairs. Go see him. He's gotta go potty. All right, I'm gonna snip it because right now they are stuck together because of the way I cut them. Snip it. I don't need to snip all of them. There we go. I'll just use these ones. All right, so now I've got my leaves cut out and I'm going to add my stems and my leaves. Wait, are we cutting? Maybe that's a lot. Yeah, so all my, just make sure all of your stems and leaves are cut out. We will do the gluing tomorrow. So tomorrow, make sure if you're cutting your, your own out, you have your glue sticks with you. If you are drying them, just make sure you have your markers handy. And I will see you then. Bye, friends.